Oh, what's up, gamers? <laughs> I, I gave you a little leeway there because you hey, screwed yourself up. She's working, Beach Ball. What you yapping? Oh, it's time for the best mission in the guy game, guys. Uh, I mean, uh, I passed sewer last time. Come on. And I passed the class two race. It's time for the greatest mission in the entire universe now. Man, where's a brooder mission when you need it? Look, that that guy could just stay dead, okay? I'm pretty sure. I'm, uh, he I think he's coming up either this part or next part, so get ready for another fun thumbnail. And I intend to win. What does he even do? Like, what is even his mission? It's the same I'm... mission every time. You have to ask. You must find more you... brut brooter guys and rescue rescue brooters. I know they're called brooters, but it's it's funny to call them brooters. <laughs> Me brooter. Aw, oh, dude, I'm ready for this death counter to go up tenfold. So, there's one of two ways this mission can go. Either I'm going to beat it first try, no problems, or I'm going to be here the entire part. You be, if you beat it first time, I... It's you know, very feasible. It does happen. I wouldn't even be too upset, but god damn, this mission's stupid. Last no, time I did it was... I know you've mentioned it. Oh, uh, yeah, I don't know if I told... It. Have I mentioned it on camera? I feel like you have. I'll mention it again anyways, just Let's in go. case people want to know. Um, so basically, if you have Dark Jack, you Dark Jack next to Errol's, or you Dark Jack, then you walk next to Errol's vehicle, and you stand oh, next to it. Oh, well, now you did. You stand next to it until it turns on fire, and you have to be really quick about this. So when it turns on fire, you immediately have to walk away and get rid of Dark Jack. Um... And because his vehicle is on fire. Oh, well, missed the ring, oh, that's it. <laughs> yeah, I screwed up. Goodbye. Yeah. It's like I would go through the menu to do the restart, but it's fa it's just fast. The menu's so slow in this game, I'm faster if I just. Do it One that way. death added to the pile. Oh, and now I got Crimson Guard after me. Lovely. That didn't take very long. That's still the reason I waited the last time, because there was that flying guard right there. They don't spawn. During the race. Imagine if they did. That'd actually be the worst thing ever. It'd be kind of fun. I know what making this sense lore wise, but I think it'd be kind of funny if they did spawn, but they went after Errol too. <laughs> so, this is, um. Whee! Whee! Um. This is a, another case of. So, he's mentioned before that in the class. Oh, in the class races, um. The rubber banding can be pretty bad. We've talked about that. Two deaths. Woohoo! So now um, imagine that again, but this time we're going around the main this, hub area. This rubber banding is uh, infinitely worse. Um, infinitely worse. It, and it's more not noticeable than the one, in, the ones in a. Uh, what's it called? I, I need to stop holding X all the time. It's basic racing strategy, but it doesn't really work super well here. It's a lot easier to turn if you stop holding gas. Or you just hold square. Cause I, or whatever the break is. I don't I think it's square that breaks. Missed it. I thought I could actually make that one. Aw oh, dang it, he crashed too. I could have caught up. It is possible to do this, like, to miss a ring and still win early on, but after you get to, like, the halfway point, if you miss a ring, it's, like, it's over. And, there, and I mean, there's... You auto-fail if you miss a ring. That's what I've been doing. No, no, you, like, you could turn around and get the ring. Oh, that was yeah. what I meant. Like, early on, I could... I, Theoretically, I would say it's yeah, it's possible. Because it's, just... it's because of the rubber banding mm -hmm. early on is just, like, he'll give you enough leeway to catch up. Oh yeah. By probably by by like the halfway point. But they're yeah, really mean. Because the last three fourths of this race, they have like two it's or pain. three fucking. That being said, by the three fourths mark, you're probably not gonna fail at that point. Uh, I beg to differ. Um, because just because there's like two rings, or at least one ring, I know they put in this really dumb location it's that good. is so easy, really easy to miss. And this is, by the way, this is roughly around the halfway point. I don't even know if that was the halfway point. Yeah, this, the Mars, 
sign is around the halfway point when we add another death. We're up to four now? Lovely. Yep. The number's just gonna keep going up and up and up. I don't know why I'm trying so hard to go fast. It, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Not now, anyway. Also, I, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, it is possible, albeit nearly impossible to do, like, just legitimately. You can technically destroy Errol's vehicle. I, I think you still Oh, yeah, can. you can. It's just... Oh, also, when we're talking about how bad the rubber banding is, um, it's been 100% confirmed. I don't know about the class races, but for this race, it is 100% confirmed that Errol, in fact, teleports. So, yeah. Oh yeah, just watch the map! Well, there's also, people have had glitches and stuff where he would get like stuck in a wall, giving them a quote-unquote free race, but then he eventually just teleports behind them and is like, nothing personnel, kid. I'll, I'll try it, see if I can pull it, well... Come on! Yeah, I'm, I'm screwed at this point. Yeah, I was about to say, I'm surprised the game didn't just auto-fail you. And yes, guys, this this game, I'm pretty sure this does game auto fails if I remember correctly. I'm not actually sure. But I'm assuming it doesn't. But I think it does if you're way too far away. Should I just test that? Just drive <laughs> way off the beaten path. If you miss one, just sit there and wait. So uh, as do, such, do, if... do, 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 la la. Look at me, I'm gonna get this ring! I'm gonna do it! There I go! Whoa! Also, yeah, those rings speed you up. I think that's the worst part, is the rings speed you up. <laughs> Don't worry, I, I, I can still win! I'm gonna <laughs> do it! I'm gonna do it! <laughs> Looks like it doesn't actually outfit. Maybe you do have to go off the, like, beaten road. I'm gonna win! I'm still holding square. Okay, yeah, I, I, at this point it's pretty obvious it doesn't fail you. Six deaths. You know, the highest number we've had for this LP for a part so far is 13. There is not- I mean, I'm planning on doing other missions for this part. I, mean, I might not end up having that kind of time, but... Yeah, I was gonna say, I mean, ideally you would want to, but I don't know necessarily if you'll have it, I mean, the time. I, I dedicated an entire Wind Waker part to just just that Sword Guys game, Orca. So, well, why not? We, ex we expected it to take way longer than For it real. ended up doing. I'm so really upset that it didn't take you as long as me. It took me forever. It seems to be a running theme. Some some things that take you forever, or, or take me forever, don't take you forever. And then it's like vice versa. Maybe it's an on-camera thing. Maybe. So a lot of the things that you seem to do a lot better than me at were not recording anything. It's just... Today is Saturday. It's not Saturday. I'm not it even is... planning on uploading this Saturday. Damn it. When are you going to upload this then? I don't know. I didn't actually check, but I don't think it's Saturday. I have six what? out of seven chance of being right. Yeah, I've got a one out of seven chance. Woo! Science is great. I still have a chance. Maybe. Probably. You do. Yeah, definitely. This is when it gets annoyingly hard, though. Like, if you screw up, like, don't even bother trying. This is where I usually catch up to him whenever I, uh, screw up. Is this little section right here? Let's see if you get that fucking troll hoop. Does hover not work here? No, or two. It does. I mean, oh, I'm yeah, too scared to check. You did get the troll hoop, by the way. It, it's that one that you get to jump off the railing for. I believe, if I remember correctly, I had severe issues getting that dumb fucking thing. Oh, Errol, you're helping. 
Thanks, buddy. <laughs> Thanks for waiting. So, I mean, once I got past the trouble spot, I got through no problem. Too cocky, outlaw. Next time we race for keeps. I messed up on that ending so many times because that stupid fucking hoop. And if you miss it, you can't go back for it. So, like, yeah. you're screwed. So I gotta go all the way back to Vin. There's a vehicle over here. All this and, and not and not only that, but there was um um what was it? The um after that that jump uh the 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 jump off the railing. I would always like run into a wall or something and I would explode. This is the worst. I hate this race. This well, like, more... That was actually pretty accurate for how I usually play this. The beginning part sucks, but then once I get past the the middle point, I'm fine. Assuming that troll part doesn't get me, because yes, that part can get me. Absolutely. Oh, we got another mission. Okay, um... Oh, this oh yeah. yeah, I'm doing this one. It's Dead closer, town. everyone. And for two, we get to use a vehicle. And I can get a bunch of precursor orbs. Oh, dude, you're gonna get a fuckload. You're gonna get them all here, probably. I mean, I don't have any at this area, do I? Yeah, it's it's blank on the document. I, I'm, I'm pretty sure they all are not in this one hoverboard section, but they're like all in this hoverboard section plus the... Uh... Yeah, they want me to go in there, which I'll get there in a minute, don't worry. I I, I want to explore a bit first. <laughs> all right. I, I know there's some over in front of me to the left, but I just want to check the whole area just to be sure. Because, come on, it's Jack 2. It's not above this game to hide something in a corner. Get ready for a wet Hope dream, everyone. And so it's basically two. I'll, I'll get it in a second. Dude, there, no, there's like seven here. As soon as I get it. There we go. Two. There's three and four. Three. Four. There's five. There's six. I think that's it. I think it's six. And then there's one up in the... I want to say the two are both on the... Because I see one right there. There, there, I, there might be one off to the side. You might want to double check just to be sure. Like I, I not... don't think this mission kicks me out of the area. So once I'm done with it, I'll go through. Because I'm, I know at least one of them's in this area. So maybe the other one is too. I hate this mission. I hate this suit. It wasn't a bad idea in theory. It's just, I don't know. I feel like it should have been more agile. Yeah, you, you literally can't dodge anything, and it, and it becomes an issue with the dudes that throw projectiles. Yeah. Basically, this is how this stupid mission goes. Basically, you you have to take as little damage as possible, because you're going to be taking damage no matter what from the stupid guys that shoot. I'm paranoid now. I'm just punching whenever I walk into a room. No, I wouldn't do that. I just second. Can I make it up there or do I need to move the block first? Oh, we can make it up there. There we go. Ooh, second. seven. Let's see where the last one is real quick. I believe it's at the end of this round, if I'm not mistaken. That's kind of what I was thinking, which is why I wanted to just go ahead and do this. On a thin platform after you push the second block, you have to push it, it with so the goofy. tight. I know. But yeah, we, we were right. Motherfucker. Control Z. There we go. Welcome to Yoga Doctor, where we desperately try to figure out technology. But we haven't done it yet. I, I, it's, I hate. I, I should not have brute forced this. I hate I Google, Google Docs. Google Docs doesn't like to work 50% of the time to me. I can get it to work a bit better than that, but it's. It's still a problem, child. It's just it's just the deleting the text from uh what's it called? The little marker or whatever you want to call it. The little like subtext I guess. So you hit the backspace button? Yeah, I hit the back like I highlight a, as much or, as I can and then I hit the backspace whatever. button. Remember to look all over the place. Oh, I know. Wait, I didn't even know you could this yeah. mission's actually way easier. If I knew you could do oh, that, there it this is. mission... I knew oh, yeah. you could do that. 
This Which uh, would have been I, so I much realized easier. how I screwed it up at that last section because you can just jump out. And here's the last one. Oh, that actually makes me kind of upset. I this, uh, I this was one of the missions I crashed. My game crashed on, or no, this was the mission my game crashed on because I, I don't remember what I did in specific to make it crash. It wasn't a CD problem. I don't think. I think I literally just like confused the game or something. And um, I crashed the game here, and I was like, "Yep, I'm not gonna bother with this shit." Then I went back to this and eventually did Daily, it. Yeah, you're intended to get out of the vehicle. Yeah, well, I didn't even know you could. They don't. There's nothing that I don't think that says you even can. So you can't in the other mech mission, so I'm not super surprised. So that's why whenever I did this mission, I thought the entire idea was you're just supposed to take as little damage as possible inside this mech because those stupid guys are going to hit you no matter what inside the mech. Hello, I'm a robot. People must... That jumping feels so off. It's like you jump up so fast and then... Whoop! And I messed my throat. Well, I gotta go back! It never comes back. Oh, hey. never mind. <laughs> my immersion has been broken. <laughs> it never comes back. Hello, friend! <laughs> I really am turning it into Ben. Friend! I guess you just want everyone to be your friend. Like at first it was just a joke with with Ocarina of Time, but now it's just spreading to everything. Like I've already done it in Echo, and here we are in Jack. I'm out of LPs. Uh, next LP. Uh, uh. Oh, dude, I have a proposition for you. You play the greatest game of all time. I spent many a day uh, up this place for I'll stop training. saying what's up, gamers. <laughs> Superman 64. <laughs> One thing I can't say yes to. Because <laughs> I literally can't beat that game. I I've tried very hard. <laughs> I mean, you can if you put your mind to it. <laughs> Plus, you also put yourself under the, this has to be an HPO thing for that, which I never understood. Because that's the point. I know, but so, let me get this straight. after a while, you just, you just gotta let it out, man. You just gotta let it out, you gotta let it loose. There's, there's your proposition. There, you, there we go. It's perfect. So, uh, everyone that's uh, looking at the uh, the uploaded videos, this is how our Superman 64 Let's Play began. <laughs> I've had that game not work several times. I've tried to beat it. I've tried. I can't beat it either. <laughs> Dude, you got farther than I did. I spent a good several hours, like, I just could not make it through the second stage. You know, the first stage that doesn't have hoops. Which, believe it or not, this that game has levels that don't involve hoops. I know, it's it's, it's, it's pretty crazy, guys. It's just that one AVGN episode that made everyone think that it has hoops. I mean, it has a lot of... I, well, I mean, he does talk about the section, I think, without hoops, just briefly. But, I mean, I can't blame him. It's literally... It, it's literally, like, 75% hoops. So, I'm, I mean, I'm not if too surprised. You basically, play that, then yeah, I think I might be stuck here. I might have jumped prematurely. Uh, you might be fine. Maybe. <laughs> sure I'm stuck. I want to say I did this exact same thing. I want to say you did this before, too. I want to say I did. Or no, I couldn't have because I didn't have the hoverboard. Maybe, maybe I didn't do this before then too. Well, add another death to the counter. I've got to go around. Come on, dude! Three more deaths. That's all you need. Yeah, okay, this area you can go down. All you need is three more deaths, and then you have double digits. 
Well, we're only 20 minutes into the part. We can go a little longer. But then I remember that the other mission is Bruder, isn't it? Uh, I mean, do I do I really want to do it? Or yeah. no, it's, it's it's not Bruder. I thought I heard Bruder, but I didn't. Me Bruder. Me want to be your friend. Okay, so I can do Onin or Lightning. Uh, would you mind checking the missions thing? Tell me what they are. <laughs> yeah, let me let me bring it up. Mission Just skim down to the arrow race because it'll be the easiest way to find it. Okay, so the missions you have here. And I did the Samus Dead Town thing too. That's what I just Samus? Did. Samos. Samos, whatever. Basically same name, just one letter. You're so close to the end of the game. Um you have Protect Samos and Haven Forest. That's probably Onins? Or destroy eggs and strip mine. That's definitely Vince. Oh, okay, Samus, Samos, Samos. <laughs> I did that one on purpose. <laughs> uh, I just find it funny. Okay, Samus. <laughs> okay, Samus, we're gonna get you your mech suit. Everything's gonna be fine. Oh, God. Also, I'm very confused about why you're an old man, but we'll just roll with it. <laughs> What's growing out of your head, Samus? <laughs> I do not know how I managed not to, to take that guard off, but I did it and I'm very happy about it. So a friend of mine just messaged me saying he just learned that the average playtime of Persona 5 is uh, 100 hours. I've told him several times it is, but he didn't believe me. I've told you that too. I know. It took me longer. Although that's because I was going for basically everything. I know you platinum the game. Oh, yeah. How long did that even take you? A very, very, very long time. Add a couple more berries you... in there too, just for good measure. Oh. Dude, it's a it's a bird seed. I was leading my hundred flocks south before you had fur one between your legs. Not that your fur means anything. I know what the thumbnail of this part will be. A close up on Jack's face. But it's so close that you can't even tell it's Jack. <laughs> it's just like a close-up of his nose. <laughs> I mean, surprisingly, there's a lot of characters I haven't done for anything yet. Like, I haven't done one to Pecker. I don't think I have... I mean, you have done I was gonna say I haven't done Owen and... I haven't done Sam. Samos. <laughs> that one was an accident. <laughs> Samus, what are you doing? You're in the wrong game. <laughs> Go to Metroid Prime 4, where you belong. <laughs> Coming out in, I don't know, 2023 or something. People have been hinting at it. They're going to talk about it. The Game Awards 2018. They also Please. said it was going to show up at E3 this year, and that didn't happen. So. No, they did not say it was going to show up. I either. heard a lot of that. They straight up, I they straight up said they weren't gonna show up, show it at three E three. Yeah, and since when have people believed anything about what Nintendo says at E three? Um, I believe they're the most honest people at E three. But nobody believes them. It's so weird. Yeah, well, they're weird. Oh, I know. It's really they're dumb. the most honest people at E three. It's like they made it very clear that like, yeah, we're not even gonna do a, a real presentation we're just gonna do a bunch of smash and other stuff we feel like showing that's what they did that's what they did it's like people were, we're upset at them over it's like no that was it like it's gonna hold up a whole lot better than bethesda's this year which aside from my usual bethesda hatred yeah how did fallout 76 turn out again <laughs> I'm, I'm just saying <laughs> it took them like a week or two to even have a formal response to everyone Uh, That's going to be fun to follow up on next year for that E3. <laughs> oh, I know. I'm half expecting... Well, no. Actually, I don't know. I want to say I'm half expecting the crowd to boo, but I don't know. Assuming they that, do a presentation, because they I, might I, be scared out of it. 
Yeah, I was about to say, I've never seen so much backlash towards a company that so many people like. I've never seen it go so hard like that. Yeah, like, the only thing I can think of that comes close, and they aren't nearly as well liked as Bethesda, would be Microsoft back in 2013. Yeah, that was, that was like, the closest thing with their whole Xbox One fiasco. But they rolled back on all oh, that stuff. Geez. This is something you can't roll back on. I mean, people thought also, the same thing about Xbox One, and they did it. They did about as good of a job as you could hope they could. Not not only that, but but Blizzard, another one. Who, a lot of companies are just hitting the shit right oh, now. Oh yeah. <laughs> what is it? Diablo Inferno, Infinite, something like that. Uh, Inferno. Yeah. With, with well, their... you all got phones, right? Yeah, yeah, I was about to say, with their famous line, <laughs> what, do you guys not have phones? That's so awkward when you get booed by your own and fans. And you still have to keep acting like it's a good idea. It's like, uh... The best part of that entire thing is, this guy literally walked up, asked a genuine question. He was like, is this an early April Fool's joke? Like... Can we, can we play and everyone this? everyone was applauding. Can we, yeah, I know. Can we play this on our TV? Like, I'm, I'm or... not a fan of the series by any means, but even I felt bad for the... I even felt bad for the presenters a little bit, because like, you know they can't backpedal on any of that. I know, you know they can't, like, say, I'm, you know, I'm sorry you're, dis you know, you're disappointed, or whatever. They can't even say, like, I'm sorry if you're disappointed by yeah, this. Yeah, they can't even do that, because it's supposed to be... It's to be something happy for fans, and nope. Well, it's supposed to be having her investors, but... <laughs> oh, this is there. why you don't join the system, guys. This mission's annoying as hell. Yeah. Although this is the first as mission I've actually used the Peacemaker in. Let that speak for itself. I love the Peacemaker. Too bad it only has 10 ammo. Mm -hmm. And a death. And, yep. Two more deaths. So, I know in Jack 3 there's a way to get more ammo. I don't remember if there's in this game too. What? Say that again. Sorry, I was distracted. I know in Jack 3 there's a way to get a higher ammo capacity. I don't know if there's in this game as well. Uh, there was the one that was got from a mission, but I don't know. Oh if yeah, it's... there's that. I'm pretty sure you can get some more through cursor orbs as well. You might. You can get menu, ammo. Which, as far as I'm concerned, that that shit is not cheat codes in that game. That they expect you to use those. You can not convince me otherwise. They are definitely they're extras. They're not really technically they're cheats by a technical sense, but they're not really cheats. They're just features you get for going out of your way. It's for structured like cheats, but it's not. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's technically cheats. Because invincibility, infinite ammo, stuff like that. But they're oh, sure. ex but they're extras put into the game. They're they're cheats by definition, but they're extra. But they're like, also they're things extras. like extra vehicles and stuff that I don't think at least most of those vehicles aren't particularly broken. There might be one that I'm not remembering, but And that's I... the downside of Peacemaker. Yeah, you died. Yeah, the it takes a couple seconds for it to decide it wants to fire. Sometimes it won't even like lock on to anything. It'll just. Oh yeah, that was happening to me too. Yeah, it'll just like fuck off and be like, I don't want to listen to you. It's like, hey, you know, I know you really want to kill this thing, but what? What if he was the one that got killed instead? Well, uh, I guess the the morph gun is Navi now. I guess so. And anyone that didn't watch Arc Arena of Time, I think is gonna be very confused. It's like every time we make a new video, we have to. Oh shit! <laughs> just dropped my phone off my face. Um, because I picked it up and it like flew in my face. But every every LP we do, we we legitimately always reference back to. I, I think the moral of the story is everyone watch the Ocarina of Time LP. And it's like the least watched LP on the channel. It's probably gonna stay that way for a while just because you know Ocarina of Time that game gets LP to death. If it was a randomizer, I could. Maybe. That's the only way I could ever see Ocarina of Time videos getting more views. Yeah. 
because the thing about randomizers is there it's literally different like every time like no route will ever be the same and, and a lot of people can actually like go out of their way to do things first uh, that you can't normally do first just for the sake of variety and I respect that I in uh, fact I need to go back trying to learn how to do my officer I have it installed on my computer I just I'm not good enough at the game <laughs> I run up to the Deku Tree and then I open up the chest out at the slingshot and I realize I am stuck. Then you realize maybe I shouldn't be in the Deku Tree. Yeah, that's what I did, but <laughs> there's not a whole lot of options. They have every everything's open. You can't leave the forest. Yeah, you can. Maybe I need to check my options again because it was locked. You're supposed to be a. They they let you do that because. It depend. I think it depends on what you're randomizing. If you're randomizing like literally everything, they open up a lot of stuff just so you, because you're literally not going to be able to do things. Because it's well, just I how I random. My charge for all this. Whee! Man, why won't you get your ten the tenth death already? I want to say I might have, and you just wasn't paying attention. Uh. I mean, I'm, I'm watching. When was the last time he died? I don't know, like maybe a minute ago. Did I miss it? What were we talking about? Uh, I think that's around the time we were talking about Navi, Ocarina of Time. We just started talking about the randomizer. I, I counted that one. Oh, well, okay. I, I believe. I mean, if I'm wrong, you can always... Correct it, but I, I'm pretty sure I counted that one. I doubt I'm even gonna check it after the fact. I'm, yeah, I'm pretty sure I counted that one. Just announce your death every time, so I don't lose track. In case I look away for like half a second. Dude, can you finish up, Samos? You've been doing this for like seven years. Those flying guys are really hard to hit, okay? At least they're like dropping exclusively peacemaker ammo. Yeah, it's really handy. It's really weird, I'm not used dying. to it. Usually it's still really rare. And there we go again. There's your either 10th or 11th death. I'm just going to assume it is 10. Unless you really think I missed it, then I'll just put a I'm weapon. not super sure anymore, so... Yeah, I'm not really ten. either. I, I feel like I did, but... I feel like I did miss it, because... I don't know, but I feel like I didn't... I don't know. I guess in the description of every future part, you're going to have to put the total number, and then in parentheses... Four plus one? Question mark? <laughs> <laughs> Screw that too much work. <laughs> I have to do enough in the description as is. What do you do in the description? I have to put in the death charts and uh, the yeah, death that's... count and all that. Which is way more than I have to do for any other LPs. Dude, it's hard enough for me to even do it. So much work, man. You're literally right. drawing a line. It's so you... hard, man. <laughs> it's hard, man. So I, I never I, I, passed I... first grade. What's a line? Yeah, what is a line? So I realized I have potentially, debatably, the worst possible guilty pleasure movie of all time. I have a guilty pleasure um, for the movie, the the live action Scooby Doo movies. Oh, I do too. I completely understand. Like I know they're terrible, oh, yeah, but they're sure, but... but they're in the realm of like this they're is so They're still enjoyable stupid. to some extent. Like like it's just it's just one of those things where you're just like this is the stupidest shit ever. I went to go watch those back in theaters way back when, and I don't regret it for a second. As terrible as they were. 
did the, I, I I watched I watched the the second one on uh, because they're both oh, on Netflix it. or Man, one must, and two. That must or... have been really close to the end every time I died. Yeah, probably. But I've been on on watching them on Netflix, and every time I watch them, I'm just like, God, these are so fucking bad, but I love them. <laughs> like, like I just know they're bad. They also make a lot of stoner jokes. Still <laughs> so, that over my little sister's guilty pleasure movie, which is very similar, actually. What's that? Live action Avatar movie. Oh god! After the Last Airbender. Oh god, <laughs> that is that is that is like just bad in every sense of the like, way. Though I was just like, I'm very confused, but I respect your life decisions. How old is she? Right now, she's either 18 or 19. At the time, I think she would have been around 13. So maybe she doesn't like it anymore. Maybe. Probably. Please. I don't even know <laughs> if she's watched it again since. <laughs> this is probably for the best. <laughs> How long has this part been going on? 36 minutes. We could probably, and now it'd be a little short, but... Look, the last part went on a lot longer than I wanted, so I don't mind having this part end a little earlier as compensation. To be fair, it also didn't. Uh, I don't think you had a single jack part that's lasted over an hour, so. I'm not sure. There might be one, but I doubt it at the same time. Well, when in doubt, playlist. The last part, part 11, was 53 minutes. <laughs> that's. Yeah, I know. That, that was the only one that we were kind of cutting close. That's why I sort of brought it up. I'm checking right now. Let's see. There's. Yeah, no, that's the longest one. Ooh. I knew it. Well, I didn't 100% know it, but I thought I knew it. So I knew it. You know now. Oh, no! What? Look at the map. What's there other than the lightning bolt for it, Vin? Brooder. 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 <laughs> You know, I really wanted to do Vin, but I don't think you're going to let me do anything other than Bruder. So next Bruder. time we're doing Bruder. 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 See you all next year. Bruder.